Okay, guys, again, good morning. And today, inshallah, we will take lesson two in chapter three compute with multi digit decimals, page 143. So prepare your box and let's start now. Let's start now. Computer. Okay, guys, leave everything and just take a look here. Yes, Najam. Mr. Sura Malaa, and Najam, yes. Mr. Sura, and now. Now. Now it is good. Still or what? No, it's still. I am Now. Now it's good. Good now? Yes. Good. Bye. I saw him. Yes, I saw him. Yeah, sir. I saw him. I only was to tell you that you uh, they write uh, to me Safwan's bandwidth, uh, band Mr. Safwan's bandwidth band is low. It's low. This is my router. It's beside me. But how about now, uh, I saw him? A little bit good. Bye. Let's start. Let's start, guys. Sultan. Yeah, Mister, it's written yes. uh, in in my. Uh... Mister, that's it. خلاص. How about now? Do you see the board now? I know I don't see something. There are lots of some points that carry just. Mister, can you see the board? Yes. Can you hear me? Yeah. خلاص. الأمور سهلة إن شاء الله. إن شاء الله. Yanar and Yanar. Yes. Mister. Uh, I can't see the board. I see only Safwan's zirkat, zirkat, and I don't see the board. I now I see it. But it's um, uh, rubbish. Now. No, still. Rubbish. Stop, check. Let me check another student. Okay. Najim, still? What, Mr. Still, uh, you can't see the board? Uh, no, if I write for me, so fun. Eh. What's happened? No, it is uh, very good. You can see. No. Yes, it is good. Now it's good. Mister? Yes. Can you make with us the question 11 in the homework? Can you see the board? Yes, it's uh, so Clear. Can you see it, uh, Yanal? Yes. Yes, it's so clear. Start, guys. Stop. Uh, stop. Stop annoying me. Stop. 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 Okay. Yeah. Let's go to example one, guys. They will talk with animals. We'll deal with animals and. Um, and we will take addition and subtraction of decimals, multiplication of decimals, and division of decimals. So let's start with addition and subtraction. We'll go directly to example one. But before doing example one, guys, the most important thing in addition and subtraction decimals is to align the two numbers correctly. To align the two decimals, guys, you need to put the decimal under decimal, then allow to the left and to the right. So to align the two decimals, guys, you need to put the decimals over each other, should be, and add or subtract normally. And we took that before, I think. Now, for example, if I have this 
2.003 plus 0.4, for example. 2.003 plus 0.4. First, how we align the two digits, guys? First of all, we need to align the decimals over the decimals, like this. Then we put the numbers to the left and to the right in both decimals. Here we have 2, 0, 0, 3. And here we have 0, 4, like this. Don't align like this this 2.003 no this is wrong this is wrong okay now the four here is tenths and the three here is thousands so we cannot add them together so the tenths under tenths the hundreds under hundreds uh, thousands under thousands and go on now if you have empty spaces you can fill them with zeros then you can add normally then you can add normally and if you have two digits you will put one on the hand everything is normal but be careful that you put these decimals over each other be careful that you put these decimals over each other so let's go to example one page 144 guys together i'm an example one page 144 together example one we have we need to add 23 decimal 498 23 decimal 498 plus plus 14 decimal 93 14 decimal 93 this is example 1 guys in page 144 Assam. Yeah, mister. Can you hear me see the board? Any yeah. problem? No, Good. no problem. No problem, stay. Nidal. Mister, I want to answer. What? Yeah, mister, I can see your board. Mister, wallahi, some of you can see, some of you cannot see, so... I don't know what to do. I need to do my class now. I'm sorry. Nidal, what do you want? I want to answer. Did I ask? No. I didn't ask. So what do you want to answer? The, uh, the question that it is in the board. Nidal, did I ask you about the question in the board? No. So if I don't ask, you won't answer. Thank you. Don't put your hand. Until I ask. Guys, focus. Focus. Allah is at you. Did you ask about the morning? Isam, everything is good. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I will start. Now here, guys, the first important thing, we said to put decimals over decimals. So here I put the two decimals first over each other. Then I will align or I will arrange the numbers. So here the first number, 23. Four, nine, eight, and make spaces between the numbers. Do not look like this. Twenty-three or four nine. No, no. Make spaces, guys. Make spaces. Make space so you won't be confused later. Okay. Now, after you put the decimals over each other, you make spaces between the digits and arrange them very well. So two, three, four, nine. Eight in this way. The second decimal it is here. Align the two numbers here on the left and the right. So here I have one, four, and nine, three. A three here it is the last number, and eight it is the last number, and it's not conditioned to be over each other. So be careful in alignment, guys. Be careful in alignment. Okay. Now add. Add normally. Here I have empty space, guys. In the empty spaces, guys, we can put what? We can add zeros. If you have empty space, you can add zeros. High zero. Add normally. Now, 8 plus 0, come on, we add it from the right, not from the left. We're starting from the right, huh? not from the left. Yalla, 8 plus 0, 8. 
9 plus 3, 12. 2 down, 1 up, normal, adding, adding. 1 plus 4, 5 with 9, 14. 4, 1 up. And the decimal comes down on the same place. The decimal comes down on the same place. Now, 1 plus 3, 4 plus 4, 8. And 2 plus 1, 3. So the answer is 38 decimal 428. I sum everything good. Yeah. Good. Fine. Yes, Mr. Yes, Yanal. You keep your hand, Yanal. Any problem? I will move it. Right. <laughs> Do you see the board, Yanal? Yes, I see it. Bye. Wafi. Mr. Yes. When uh, your uh, camera being black, I know why. Because when you take a uh, student uh, to answer. I know, Mr. I know, I know. It's temporarily. When I talk with a student, I go to him, to his, to his camera. So sometimes the Zoom takes the camera of the student. So we need to, we get used of that. So it's okay. Now let's continue, Wafi. Do you see the board there, Wafi? Yeah, I see it. Good. That's the important thing. Okay, guys, so to add, we put the decimals over each other, align the numbers as I told you, then we add normally. So this is example one. We have checked under example one. We have checked, guys, under example one. See the check? Do it. Do the check, guys, under example one. Check. Check a question. Do it in your book now. Align the two decimals and add them. Here go. Align the two numbers, guys. Yes, Yusuf? Uh, I'm done. طيب, شو أعمل لك? Uh, can I answer, يعني? Mister, did I ask? No. no. We are not kids, guys. إحنا شو لد صغار إحنا. لما بسأل, بتجاوب. ما بسأل, خلاص تسكت وبتنتبه بس thank you remove your hand I removed thank you now let's align together let's align together let me close the door please now <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, where are you, Nidal Bek? Nidal, where are you? Put your hand, Nidal. Nidal, I want to ask, put your hand. When I want to ask a question, I don't want We will put the 356. No, Decimal. no, 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 it's wrong. It's wrong. We will, will align him. No, it's wrong. What we will put the first? The decimals. Tell me what I will do. Tell me what I will do. Yalla. We'll put decimal down and the second, the same place, but down. Ah. First, the two decimals. Then, yeah. Two numbers, three well, three, five, six, six. and seven, seven two, two, five, and here one, four, two, one. and four. Four and zero and zero. Now here we have two empty spaces. We fill them with zeros. Why we can add zeros, guys? Because in the decimal you can add zeros to the to the um, to the farthest um, right and to the farthest left. So it's okay. No change in the value. Now we add normally 5 plus 0, 
11. The decimal, don't forget it, comes on it's the same place. Decimal, decimal, decimal. Okay, now seven plus two, eight. Nine. Five plus four, oh, sorry, nine. Five plus four, command nine, with three plus four, one, four. four. So what's the answer here, guys? 499 decimal, one, two, five. I can read it like 499, one, 125 thousandths with THS. Remember? Thousandths, THS. Thousands, when I add THS, I'm talking about decimals here. So this is the check question, check your answer. And let's go to example two directly. Let's go to example two directly. I'll go to example two. Yeah, we have find 163 decimal 45. This is example two guys. 163 decimal 45 minus minus 85 decimal 374 85 decimal 374 now we will deal with subtraction as we did with addition same alignment same conditions we put the decimals over each other then align then subtract normally as normal numbers. So here I'll put the two decimals over each other first, decimal over decimal. Then I align the digits, one, six, three, four, five, here eight, five, and the three, seven, four. Line, subtract. Now here we have empty spaces. Here we have one empty space, zero. Here we have two, one empty space also. I add the two zeros. Now let's subtract normally. Do not align like this. 163, decimal 45, and here 85, decimal 374. Oh, oh, Now let's subtract normally. Zero minus four, it's not four. Zero minus four, it is not four. We ca it cannot be, borrow one. This will be four, this will be 10. Subtract normally, 10 minus four, six. Four minus seven, it cannot be. This will be three, this will be 14. Subtract 14 minus seven, seven. Now three minus three, zero. Decimal comes in its place. Three minus five, it cannot be. This will be five, this will be 13. 13 minus five, eight. Five minus eight, it cannot be. Take this one. And the five will be 15 minus eight is seven. So the answer is 78 decimal 76. 78 decimal 76. Now find the check guys under of this. The check, if you don't have any questions, do the check under of this one. We have a question um, 356 decimal. 18 minus 142 decimal 257. 142 decimal 25 or 3, sorry, 257. Go. If you have questions about this, guys, put your hand. How to add, how to subtract. Aysan. Ali Sotak, Aysan. Yeah, yeah. Ehki. Uh, nothing, Mr. Tay. Umlay. Mish habbar aftar alayk liyom. Mish habbar aftar alayk. Ehda. Nidal. تيجي بتيجي على المدرسة وين حتروح؟ اوكي okay, guys now let's do it so we'll move to multiplication it's only subtraction so I, th I don't think that 
it's very difficult on you. So let's align the two decimals quickly. So here we have decimal over decimal. And here we align the first number, three, five, six, one, eight. The second number, one, four, two, two, five, seven, two, five, seven. Line, you have one empty space, fill it with zero, then do subtraction normally. Okay, now, Lafer. Dafer. Hi, Mr. Tokyo Dafer. What we'll do here? Dafer. Tab ish had yani. A kif hek yani kif. Dafer talk. Yanal. Yanal Muhammad. Yes, Mr. Okay, Yanal. What I will do here? Zero cannot, zero cannot, uh, cannot minus seven, so we'll make uh, the, the zero ten and the eight seven. Yeah, we will borrow one. This will be seven, this will be ten. So, ten minus seven. Three. Three. Seven minus five. Two. Ikhlas. One minus two. Cannot be 11 and Cannot we will be. go from the six. Yeah, we will go to the six before the decimal here. This six will be five and this one will be 11. 11 minus two, nine. The decimal comes down. Nine. Five minus two, three. Five minus four, three. one. Three minus one, one. two. Two. So the answer 213,923. Thousands. This, this is how we add, how we subtract decimals, guys. Let's move where? To multiplication. Let's multiply. Let's multiply. Now, to multiply decimals, guys, first we multiply without decimals, then we put the decimal. First we multiply without decimals, then we put the decimal. So let's move to example three. Example three, it's all, uh, also subtraction. I want to do example three, guys, before we move there. Let me do example three for the subtraction because we have a number without decimal before we move to the multiplication. So I have 25 minus, minus 17 decimal 469. This 25 has no decimal. This is 25 here, has no decimal. So you put decimal and zeros, it's okay. So 25 has no decimal, you put decimal. Adi, and put the other decimal down here. Align the second number, one, seven, four, six, nine. Line, here we have empty spaces, fill them with zeros. Fill them with zeros, okay. Now here, Three zeros, one, two, three, and subtract normally. So here the 25 guys has no decimal. I put the decimal and zeros and align normally, normally. Now zero minus nine, zero minus six, zero minus four, it cannot be. So we'll borrow five here, we'll borrow one. This five will be four, this 10, zero will be 10, it will be nine, 10, nine, and this 10. You know that. Now 10 minus 9, 1, 9 minus 6, 3, 9 minus 4, 5, the decimal comes down, 4 minus 7, it cannot be, so this will be 1, this will be 14, 7, and 0. This 0, no need to write. So it is 7 decimal 531 thousands, okay? This is the subtraction. Now let's go to uh, uh, multiplication directly. You have check under this subtraction, guys. You can do it later. Let's multiply now. Now, 0, 0.0, I will go to example 4, guys. I'm in example 4 now. 0 0.067, 0 0.067, multiply, multiply 1.42, 1.42. 
1.42. Now, let's multiply, guys. Here, first we multiply without decimals. Again, multiply without decimals. Here we have 67 and zero. Ah, zero, six, seven. This zero, no need in multiply, right? Because without decimal, this zero has no value. And here we have 142. So what are multiply, guys? I'll put 142, multiply 6, 7, like this. Why I put the 6, 7 down? Because it has two digits. Because I removed the zeros, guys, uh, the decimals. So this zero has no, has no value. So I, I take the two digits, 6 and 7, and 142 up and multiply normally. Let's remember how we multiply two digits with the three digits. We start with 7. 7 times 2 is 14. This is 4, 1 up. 7 times 4, 28, with 1, 29. 9, 2 up. Okay, 7 by 1, 7 with 2, 9. Now I finished with the 7. I go down the second line, start with 0 always, as we did in grade 5, and multiply. 6 by 2, 12, 2 with 1 up. 6 by 4, 25, with 1, 26. 6 with 2 up, 6 by 1, 6 with 2, 8. Now line, here is 0, and then... 4, 24. Plus 1. 25. 24. I'm going to put it. I'm going to put it. Hey, oh, that's 5, right? You put 26. I'm going to put it. 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 Yes, add. Now let's add the two, digit, the two numbers here, 4, 11, 15, 9, right? Yes. Now, the important thing, how to make our answer. So we put the answer, guys. The answer is 9, 5, 1, 4. And we've got the first number here. How many digits after the decimal, not before, after the decimal? Here we have how many digits? It's three digits. And here after the decimal, we have two digits. So here we count. One, two, three, four, five. I will go to my answer, starting from the right, not from the left, from the right, and count five digits. Then I put my, my decimal. So one, two, three, four. I don't have five digits. So what I will do, I will erase this equal and add zero to make them five digits and put my decimal okay guys again again i have this answer i want to make it now the answer of the question okay i put my answer here of the multiplication without decimals and uh, unnecessary zeros then i will count the digits after each decimals in both numbers here i have three digits here i have two digits the one and the zero are not countable, okay? I count always what the digits after the decimal, to the right of the decimal. So here, one, two, three, four, five. I will go to my answer, starting from the right, not from the left, and count five digits. One, two, three, four. I don't have five. I add zeros here, not here. So here I need to add one zero to make them five digits. Then I put my decimal. This is blessed, don't leave it free. Don't leave it uh, free, just fill it with zero. Don't leave it empty. So the answer is 0 0.09514. 0 0.09514. This is example four, page. Page, which page? Page 148. Let's do the check. Yeah, let's do the check. Under of this under of this question, let's do the check, guys, together. Go and do the check because I'm running out of time, so I will delay the uh, division until tomorrow. Yeah, let's do the check, guys, together. Under this one, page 148. I have in the check question, I have 14 decimal seven, 14 
decimal. 7 multiply with 11.361. 11.361. To save time, guys, please focus here. I'm running off time. Please focus with me here. Now here, this number has more digits. In the subtraction, the number, the first number always up, right? In the multiplication, guys, the number with more digits, we put it up to make it easy for us. So here I have three digits without the decimal, five digits without the decimal. So I'll put the number with five digits without decimals. Do not put decimals in multiplication. So this is one, one, three, six, one. Under of it, I have these three digits, guys. And focus, please. One, four, no, like this. One, four, seven. Multiply. Here I have it. three digits times five digits. So down will be three lines. Down will be three lines. Yeah, let's start. Seven by one, seven. Seven by six, 42. Two down, four up. Seven by three, 21. With four, 25, five down, two up. Seven by one, seven. With two, nine. Seven by one, seven. This is for seven. Now down, we start with zero. The second line, we start with one zero. And do the same for the four, multiply. I don't need these numbers now. Now four by one, four. Four by six, 24. Four down, two up. 4 by 3, 12, with 2, 14. 4 down, 1 up. 4 by 1, 4, with 1, 5. 4 by 1, 4. I finished with 4. Now the third line, the third line, now the second line, we start with 0. We know that. The third line, we start with two zeros. The third line, we start with two zeros. The second line, we start with zero. The first line, no, normal. Now let's do the number one. One by one, one. One by six, six. One by three, three. These numbers for the four. It's not for the one. One by one, one. One by one, one. Line. Here we have empty spaces, fill it with zeros. Then what? Add. Add these three lines of numbers. So here's seven, six, 10, 10, 14, 20. Uh, here, nine, 10 with seven, 17. Two with four, six, and this is one. Now to make our decimal, guys, where we put the decimal? This is our answer, but not it's the final answer. So I need to go here. Here, how many digits after the decimal I have? I have one digit. And here, three digits. So here I have one digit, and here I have three digits. Count them together, we have four digits. Now go down to your answer, starting from, first you put the answer, one, six, seven, zero, zero, six, seven. One, six, seven, zero, zero, six, seven. Now, we have four digits, as we said, Go here from the right, count four digits, one, two, three, four, then put your decimal. I have that phrase, and uh, 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 my brother helped me. Ibrahim. Mr. كان بدي هذا كان بدي أقول لك عن الواجب هلا نبعت ولا لا؟ It's up to you. I we said we'll do the homework together here, right? Like yes. yesterday. So if, if you like to solve it during the exam, this is only during the exams because I I want to make free time for you, more time for you to study the exam. But anyway, tomorrow we'll do the homework together. Okay, thank you. Okay. So this is the multiplication of decimals, guys. Still one part for tomorrow, which is the division. If you want to get to practice, you can do the exercises of addition, subtraction, multiplication of decimals in your practice book. Now, any, any questions, guys, before I log 
out. Yanal. Mister, uh, I want to solve them, uh, but I, until the division, I'll not solve it. I'll send it yeah, to yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good. Yes. Yes, it's okay. Do not do the division. We didn't take it yet. Tomorrow, inshallah, okay, we'll take it. Okay, you know. But this is how to multiply, guys, how to add, how to subtract. So today we talk three operations of decimals. Thank you so much. You can stop it, Assam.